Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. When we last left off, well, we got a trio of morons to take out. Well, that's fine. Let's get to work. Ooh, yeah, that's fine, actually. Hey guys. There we go. You didn't need those pesky shields after all, did you? No, no, you did not. There we go. So, from what I could understand... Oh, nice. The only free weapons we get in this game are this. Yep, I knew that was going to happen. Are this weapon here. And the shotgun, I believe. I'm sure you get a rifle, though. I'm trying to remember what other free weapons there are. There's the rifle, the shotgun. Um, I know we get the striker as well. I can't even remember, but I'm sure you got a rifle. You kind of, well, maybe not required, but it, it's helpful. Definitely helpful. Yep, run, run, run. Okay, there we go. Um, This is a little bit awkward. This is definitely going to get a little bit more awkward before it gets better I think still let's see what we can do with a knife the more we can kill with a knife the better our chances will be there we go oh lovely this is working out rather well yes come into my kill zone um that could not really have gone much better could it so if we stay here because they have to come around the corner into my kill. Oh no, he 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 was having none of my nonsense. Can we even hit him still? Yeah, we can. Man, that was a very good way of saving a load of ammo. That works. <laughs> oh, sweet merciful Jesus. Uh oh, that's not what we wanted. That's really not what we wanted. Is he gonna... Yeah, he's gonna come out to play. Uh oh, get off me. Alright, this is where our plan kind of starts falling down a little bit. Uh, that'll do. Ow! Thanks, dude. Uh oh. Let's get some health going, because this is going to get a lot worse before it gets better. Okay. Oh, good. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Uh, this might actually be worth a flash. To be honest. Maybe? No, because the little bastard is still alive. Which is unfortunate. So you can't flash those guys until they've uh, fully emerged, apparently. Ooh. What's so funny, Slick? Uh, so it's just Mr. Rocket over there. Not convinced he's going to do himself any favours. <laughs> you silly bastard. That's fine. Um. Oh. Uh. What do we do with those ones up there? Do we do anything with them? They're not really worth our time, are they? I and mean, they don't even appear to be armed. Which is unfortunate for them, to say the least. Uh, so, what? So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Sixty-six rifle bullets. Ah, uh, yeah, that's not that's not too bad, is it? Not too bad at all. Oh, there's no point in killing those guys behind us. Oh, good, good, lovely. Perfect, even. 
Yeah, this is going to be really painful. Right, let's stand here and see if we can't trick these guys around the corner again. Not sure how this is going to work, if it is going to work. Yeah, kind of. No, not really. Not really. Yeah, apparently they can hear the... Yep. Ow. Thanks, dude. Cheers. You know, why not stop there? Why don't you go for ten hits? Ah. You know what? Is it worth it? I honestly don't know if this is worth it. I mean, technically, that did 13 shots of damage. So, possibly worth it? They say possibly. Now we're going to gingerly walk out the way. Whilst he goes schizo. He's going to walk towards me, isn't he? Maybe. That's fine. All the time. Oh. I mean, that also works. Uh-oh. 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 Ow. My face. My beautiful face. Oh, God. I do not like you. I really do not like you. Oh, good. His friend's here. Perfect. Just what we wanted. Yeah, this is a little bit... Oh, okay. Only one of them has the super heavy armor. Which is nice. Oh, good. Oh, good. 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 Lovely. Perfect. Oh, aren't you a little darling? Look at you. Fucking Chad Thundercock. With your big, impressive, burly armor. And your large, oversized, overcompensating claws. You fucking dick. Oh, really? Apparently, that didn't do any damage to him at all. Apparently. Because reasons. I guess. Always with the reasons. Uh, should we try a grenade? I mean, I can't see, to be honest, a grenade doing anything. Uh, definitely didn't help us much there. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. Nope, nope, we're good. We're at. Oh! Apparently, we're fine. Right, hopefully, that guy. Oh, he gave us an F8 spray. I mean, cool, I guess. Oh, good. They just all decide to charge up there. Run! Run around the corner. Get off me. Get off. Yeah, this is definitely getting worse before it gets better, isn't it? Absolutely. frickin lootly Great. Lovely. Perfect. Oh, man, this is going to suck. Oh, good God. Okay. We might need to bring out the nuclear option for these guys. Yeah. Because the shotgun is 100% ineffective. Like, it does nothing at all. Unfortunately. And this handgun here literally does nothing as well. Because it's the shitty handgun. 
Really? Well, that worked. Really? Get off me, you fucking dick. Actually, that probably helped more than you think. Uh, now, so we've got another herb. We're about to get another herb. I really don't want to use my magnum ammo on these guys, but, uh... I might have to. Because, otherwise... Okay. Not sure why he's doing that. But, I'm not exactly complaining either. Oh, that was nice. Definitely happy with that. Right, let's try and get out the fucking way. Jeez. Oh, right, he's gone. And that guy survived a magnum. It's a second-hand magnum round that had already gone through his friend, but he still survived a magnum. Dude. Inconsistent range on the old... Uh, on the old knife swing there. Yeah, this is not the way I wanted to do this, but... If it works, it works at the end of the day. Oh, for fuck's sake. If in doubt, get the nades out, I guess. Whoa, how did you know exactly where I was? See, that's one thing that bugs me. When they're alerted, they know exactly where you are until they decide that they're not alerted anymore. Right, he's done. And we didn't exactly... Wow, we used enough magnum ammo. Definitely used enough magnum ammo. But, we preserved a lot of our basic ammo as well, so... I guess that's a result, I'm not sure. Incendiary grenade, cool, I guess. We'll take it. Uh... No goodies here, apparently. Alright. That surprises me. Yeah, we we're never going to kill those things. <laughs> we're never going to kill those things with the standard shotgun and the handgun. Yeah, it's not going to happen. There's no way. Not a fucking chance. It's just too useless. But then I suppose, you know, that's what the nuclear option of the handgun is there for, I guess. Uh, nothing here, no. Ashley. Leon! <laughs> Leon! Mr. Kennedy, don't you know when it's time to throw in the towel? No! No! Ah, uh, that's one nice thing about having a controller. Hmm. Where's the satisfying sound of one's impalement? <laughs> Leon's too good for that shit. How dare you! No more games! Kill him! Kill! Quickly! We shall prepare for the ritual! I love their robes. Amazing. Leon, you're alive. Yes. It's Leon. Of course he's alive. So maybe you have nine lives, but it doesn't matter now, Mr. Kennedy. I've sent my right hand to dispose of you. Your right hand comes off? <laughs> Say whatever you please. Die, you worm! <laughs> Die, you worm! It is not me that's going to be dying, I can assure you. <clears throat> Ooh. However, it looks like a lot of other people have succumbed. Not sure who these people are. 
You got the crown, we do. Getting the crown is easy. Getting the jewel to go in the crown, well, that's another matter. This is where the game's going to be a little bit of a penis. Now. Pretty sure. Don't you get the striker here somewhere? Or is this where you could... Ah, wait. Is this where you can buy the striker? I thought you got the striker for free. Welcome. Let's find Not out. Some rare things on what are you buying? Right, yes, of course. Of course. Of course, yes. Why did I think you got the fucking striker for free? Oh. Hmm. Well, we're going to sell the TMP because there's no point in TMP ammo, I should say. Is that all strange? I guess that is all. Thank you. Broken butterfly, shotgun. We've got a lot of magnum ammo now, I think. We've got a first aid spray as well, which is probably going to be handy here. Thank you. Red eye, butterfly, gold bangle. Is that all? And the crown. Crown with two divots, like something might fit inside. Mm hmm. Oh man. Come back any time. Yes, we'll be back. I guess. Now. Now, now, now. Now we are in for some shit. I can tell you that much. Oh boy. Definitely uh, in for a rough time, Leon. I don't want to alarm you. Alright, but things are about to get ugly. Uh, actually, there is something that I do want to try. Something that I've read. It's not in my guide. It's something that I've read on a forum. And I fail to believe it. But, I do want to give it a go. I need to look up and find out what weapons you actually get for free. Because if we don't get the rifle, a rifle for free, there's no point. I'm going to go back and save it. Ah, uh, no. No, we, we just use continues if we have to. It's fine. I don't care that much. Hello, pal. Nice to see you once more. Alright, let's keep going. So, here we have. Alright, oh, yes. I right, well, we won't be going there anytime soon. Hey, dude. Yeah, so our friend isn't actually physically around here. He's just... LN2, liquid nitrogen. What's it doing here? Well, it's going to save our ass, potentially. Now... That's our ticket out of here. Our ticket to ride, but there's no such hope. It's an elevator shaft. Bring the elevator up. Uh, yes. It looks like it's not responding. The power must be out. The power is most definitely out, Leon. But. Ooh. Oh, shit. Wrong triggers. <laughs> there we go. So, there's LN2 there. I think there's some LN2 in here. There is. There's four of these containers from what I can remember. Now, we can only hurt him if we freeze him with LN2. 
which is problematic. But apparently, it, now I've heard this, and I need to put this to test. Apparently, it doesn't matter how much damage you do to him. As long as you use every LN2 tank, of which there's four, he will die automatically. Now, I haven't tested this, so I can't say how accurate it is. But, let's give it a go. It's a power unit. Yep, we're going to turn the power on. Now we're going to get locked in here. Which is awkward. Please wait approximately four minutes for the elevator to arrive. Okay. Now. We have to just run around and hope that we don't get horribly murdered. This is kind of an awkward part of the game, to be honest. So from what I can understand, you can hit him four times every time that uh, you freeze him with LN2. Now, that's fine. Oh, you are a ugly motherfucker, aren't you? Ow, thanks. So it doesn't matter what you hit him with. Right, let's knock this over. So there we go. And then we can kick him. So. He will stay frozen. He will stay frozen for 30 seconds. With each tank. Now, this is experimentation, of course. So we might have to do them again with some better weapons. But for now, let's see how far we get. Uh oh. Yep, knew I was gonna get a hit there. Thanks, you fucking dickhead. We're just going to keep running. Now, this is kind of... Oh, God. This is kind of an annoying boss, to be honest. As you can plainly see. It's actually, you know, kind of stupid as well. Just trapped in a room with this boss. Oh, yeah. That can trigger up to four times as well. I forgot about that. So, essentially, you're locked in a room... Where there's nothing you can do apart from try to survive. Not a fan of that mechanic at all. Kind of stupid. Anyway. We're free. So, with the power restored. Let's see if we can't... Make his day significantly worse. Now, also... They recommend not shooting him whilst he's kicked down. Because apparently, he actually has higher endurance when he's kicked over. Which, again, I can't confirm. Um, now... I guess really we could switch up to the handgun. Yeah, because this theory to me is starting to sound a little bit like BS. But we'll give him the benefit of the doubt. Oh, come on. Really? Dude, you know how doors work. Do you need me to let you in? Do you really not know how a door works? There you go. I'll let you in because I'm a nice guy. There we go. Fuck me, the penny dropped. Oh, 
I like the way he disappears as well in those scenes. Now this is going to suck because we need to reload. But that's okay. Just going to keep keep firing, keep plugging away. Right, there we go. Now let's go. So in theory, we should only have to knock the uh, ooze over once more. Pretty sure the last LN tank is in here. Ow, thanks, dude. Thanks for getting another free hit on me. I uh, wish you could reload in your inventory, which of course you can't in this one. Uh, do we go on? Knew this was going to be expensive. Knew this was going to be expensive. There we go. There we are. Let's switch up to the shotty, just because. Interesting. So, that theory was not accurate at all. I didn't think so. That sounded way too easy to me. Now, you can't actually hurt him, I don't think, at all. Now, did we use all the LN tanks? Or is there... Ow. Is there another one? Down here. Now, remember, this is for research. Is there another LN tank down here? No, there isn't, so we balls it up. Okay, fair enough. I was gonna say that didn't that seemed very suspiciously easy to me. Um right. How do you Right, retry from a checkpoint, there we go. So let's try that again, but we're gonna use the same method, obviously. But we're actually gonna use proper weapons. Like the broken butterfly. I was going to say, maybe on some version of the game that was actually an, uh, a thing that was true. But it's definitely not true in reality. Hmm. But I'm glad we put it to the test anyway. Yeah, you know, for science. So we break out the old... Uh, broken butterfly. I mean, we could use the rocket launcher. The good old nuclear option. But that just seems like such a waste of a rocket launcher. I mean, I guess people could... Oh, God. People could also say that uh, magnum rounds would be a waste. But depending on the RNG of the game, we're going to get more magnum rounds. So that's not really anything to worry about. I knew that just sounded so stupid. Funny enough, the guy was taking the piss out of everyone as well, going on about his theory. Like, oh, you lot are stupid. You just used 16 handgun bullets. Like, there's no way, no way it's going to be that easy. Not a chance in hell. But then, who knows? Maybe in some version of the game. That did actually happen, I don't know. There's been so many different versions and re-releases of this game. But it's entirely possible. But unfortunately, we do have to do this bloody stupid bit again. We're also going to be a bit more careful, try not to get hit as much. But, you know, famous last words. 
Because you get 30 seconds. 30 seconds. It's all the time I have to play with you. 30 seconds. Oh, come on. I, I dodged. You penis. I actually dodged. Right. And then kick him over. Come on. Right, okay. So that's the other thing. Once you've done enough damage to him, regardless of how the timer's going, he will just get out of that state. We need to reload, so we're probably going to get a hit here, but that's fine. Ow. At least we've reloaded. So I think we only have to shoot him like three or four times. Ow. I uh, definitely pushed it, the button there as well. Oh, uh, come on. I mean, we could save all of this just by using the rocket launcher, but I just don't want to use the rocket launcher, man. Might save that. Really, we actually dodged and we still got hit. Why not, right? I guess. Ow. Oh, I hate this part of the game. It's so anus. Even with all the weapons, it's just such an awful bit of game design. Terrible game design. Right, there we go. Can I have my door open now, please? Come on, open the door. Let us through. Please. Really need to go through the door now, game. Okay. Oh, God. Yeah, because look at, I mean, look at this for game design. Just running around. Waiting for an invisible timer to tick down. There's definitely some aspects of this game that have aged rather terribly. Rather poorly indeed. Now, I'm not sure that I would go as far as saying this game is overrated like a lot of people seem to think, but because obviously, you know, for, for what it did for gaming, it was very important. But I would say it's not the masterpiece. And it doesn't, it's, you know, the, a lot of people seem to think. It's a very good game. But, yeah, there's a lot of parts of this game that are just, yeah. Ugh, come on. And of course it changed, ooh, God, it changed Resident Evil forever as well. Uh, now, I guess we're going to use that. Can the door do the thing now, please? It must have been four minutes. Uh. Wait a minute. Did I not... Did I not push the button? I may not have pushed the button. Possibly didn't push the button. Definitely didn't push the button. Yeah, I think what would have been cool is if you had some kind of guard or block um, ability. That would have helped out in situations like this. Okay, so it doesn't matter whether you push the button or not. Right, got you. Okay. Now, let's go take this guy out, shall we? That's if we actually do have enough firepower. We sh should do. Because although he's tough, he's not super godlike tough. We just need to be very careful with our bullets. And that was bullshit. That was actual bullshit. All right. So is that. 
Now, how many times can we hit him, I wonder? One, two, three, four. Okay, so we can hit him four times. So we may have to use something with a little bit more poke to it. Alright, we're also going to have to wait a while for him to break through the door. Actually, do we have any more? Yeah, we've got... Uh-oh. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. You're not as menacing as you think you are. I'm sorry to break this news to you. Right. That's all she wrote for that. Right, cool. That's fine. That's fine. So the shotgun's basically all we have left. That's pretty bad. The shotgun is fucking awful. Or well, at least the shotgun we have is fucking awful anyway. But we did try for science. Come on, dude. Come on. There we go. I'm hoping that we, like I say, that we do actually have the firepower to do this guy in. Thank you. Thought he was going to be a dick then. Be a cheating little git. Reload. Reload. Ow. Ooh. He's not that faced by this at all, is he? Now, nah, we're in trouble. Definitely in trouble now. Oh, God. So, whether... Okay, we actually did get him. He just took... Basically everything we had. Ah, <sighs> right. Okay. Yeah, he took pretty much everything we had. Although, we did save. Actually, we didn't do that bad, really. I mean, we used all of our health, which is fine, because health generally isn't too hard to uh, recoup. Um, and we used all of our magnum rounds, which, eh, it doesn't really matter, is it? Anyway, let's get out of here. It seems that Salazar is having difficulty taming the American pig. The American pig. Salazar had his chance. Krauser, go get the girl. Oh, and uh, dispose of the swine while you're at it. Consider it done. Here's Chad Thundercock. Ah, that's actually quite a nice little place to save the game as well all right yeah interesting so we've disregarded some bullshit we had some fun we shot uh the right hand man in the face a few times uh and you know actually managed to defeat him without using the rocket launcher which i'm quite happy about because you know having one of those things in your back pocket is never a bad thing anyway guys i'm gonna have to leave it there thank you very much for watching and as always till next time